Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Sex Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix your mic not working in Discord. So let's go on down to user settings right here and select this. And then on the left side, let's go down to voice and video. Now under voice and video, we can select the default input device, which will be our microphone. So you can see you got my Fifine microphone under here. You can go to show more to see more devices connected. And then the output device will be our headset or speaker. Just select it manually under here, and then you can increase or decrease the volume of your microphone right here. So this one's at 100%, and that might be too much. And then we got the output device. Uh, this is going to be for our speakers. So you can do a quick microphone check right here and just see if it's working. It looks like it's doing well. And then we can go on down, and we got uh, the different input profiles. We got input modes, and then we got the input sensitivity. So uh, I just check mark automatically determine the input sensitivity and this will get rid of some of the background noise. And then we got echo cancellation. So all this is looking good under here. Now, if it's still not working and you got everything set up under here, we probably have to go through the different options uh, specifically on our computer. So let's go through here now and back out of Discord and go down to start and then go to settings. Now under here, let's go on down to system. Go to the right, go to sound. So you can choose the output device on the top right here. And we can go to our speaker or our microphone. So let's go to my microphone. I can see I got mine right here, the Fifine microphone, the device default. And I can go in here, make sure it says don't allow. So if you hit don't allow, you can disable it on your computer. And then we have input volume. Uh, make sure this is just loud enough under this setting. On Discord, it was set to 100%, but on here, it was only set to 47%. So we can increase it more. We can do another sound test right here, too. So let's back out to sound and then scroll on down. And let's go on over to Volume Mixer and just find Discord. And make sure you're not setting a bunch of different random things under here, too. So you can go to Discord and you can set the input device uh, manually under here for the application as well. Then we can go back to sound and go all the way down and go to more sound settings and open this up go on over to recording and then go to your microphone and set it as the default device right here so highlight it and go to set as default device and go to properties and you can listen to the device just hit apply and you can hear yourself speak through your microphone and then you can change the levels right here too and you might have some more options under advanced. Now, if it's still not working under here, we want to go over to privacy and security. Scroll on down, go to your microphone for app permissions. And make sure you have uh, permissions granted to Discord. So if you have it disabled, you won't be able to use your microphone for Discord. So it looks like everything is turned on. I'm good. Now let's go down to search. Then go up to the top and type in device manager and open this up. Now, when this opens up, uh, we can go up to the top now and we can go to output and input device. And we can look for our microphone on here. So here's my Fifine microphone. I can double click on it. Go on over to drivers and we can uninstall the driver and then install the driver by going to update driver. And we can just make sure the driver isn't the issue. And it looks like this device is working properly. Now, if the device is not showing up under this list, we can go to view and go to show hidden devices. And if it's not showing up, it could just be simply disabled. So you can have a connection issue. Uh, for example, this one says currently this hardware device is not connected to the computer. To fix this problem, reconnect this device to the computer. So. Uh, I'm going to have to go through the Bluetooth options and reconnect this one because it is a headset microphone. And I can go to Bluetooth and devices right here. And we can go to view more devices. So if you already have it connected to your computer, you might want to go to it and just remove it and then just simply reconnect it. So I can see my Stealth 700 right here. It's not connected. I can just go to remove. Then go up to add device and go to Bluetooth devices and just simply re-add it to your computer. And then hopefully that would fix your issues with it. So if it's uh, connected with a USB cable, just try a different USB slot, restart your computer, and hopefully that will fix it as well. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below.